Hey everyone, this is James with WSTrades.com. I want to provide an update here on ticker WISH or Context Logic Inc. Before I get to this update, I want to say if you are looking for a trading platform and if you would like some free stock, head to the comments and description section of this video. If you use that link to sign up for Moomoo, you can receive 10 free stocks. All right, so fresh news story here today for WISH or Context Logic Inc. Interim CEO here is coming in as Wish ditches new CEO after just seven months. So interim CEO will be third top exec in less than a year for struggling e-commerce company. Struggling e-commerce company Wish announced Thursday afternoon that its chief executive is departing the company immediately, only seven months after he was named to the post. Context Logic Inc. or Wish, the parent of company Wish, announced that Vijay Talwar had departed the company and board effective immediately, though he will be available as needed. He will be replaced on an interim basis by Joe Yan, operating partner at venture capital firm GGV Capital and a former executive for Wish, as well as several other tech companies. So a quote here uh, from the chairman. We thank VJ for his service and commitment to Wish over the past several months and welcome Joe to lead the company during this transition period. Joe's deep understanding of e-commerce and cross-border business, as well as his domain knowledge of Wish's business, make him uniquely qualified and the right culture fit to keep the company's transformation plan progressing during the search for a permanent CEO. Wish hired Talwar away from Foot Locker on January 31st of this year a couple months after Wish founder announced that he would step down by February 1st. Their successor on an interim basis, Jan, has previously worked for Alibaba, Alphabet or Google, and Amazon, according to Wish, and will retain his role at GGV Capital while serving as interim CEO. GGV Capital invested in Wish when it was a private company and holds 4.3% of the stock, according to FactSet. GGV has the third largest stake of any insider, according to FactSet Records, behind only Formation 8 Partners, LLC. The Context Logic Board has hired a national search firm to find a permanent chief executive, according to the announcement. In Thursday's announcement, Wish also reiterated its third quarter guidance for an adjusted EBITDA loss of $110 million to $130 million. Shares fell about 1% in after-hours trading following the announcement. Wish stock has fallen more than 60% so far this year, as the S&P 500 has declined 16.5%. All right, so after that little decline there, we are pop popping off pretty good here today. Let me cut this chart about in half. Just look at some price action. You can see a big move here as we were trading pre-market around a buck 20, and this thing is up around 131, 132 now. So that definitely looks like a key area to me um, around the level that it's trading right now. I would say if it can get above where it's at right now at 132 and close above that level, you definitely see this thing coming up here to 133, 134, challenging those levels. And then I kind of like to see what happens there. Um, you can see a bunch of candles back here on the beginning of the chart, uh, rejecting that level, trying to hold it as support. So it definitely seems pretty key to me. Um, but also just to the downside, um, the 130 level also looks pretty key. I think if we get a close below that level here um, on the 15 minute time frame, this thing could come down here and challenge this area of about a buck 28. So are some key prices I'm looking at on the 15 minute time frame here for ticker WISH or Context Logic Inc. Please like this video. Please also subscribe to the channel if you're not subscribed. Hit that notification bell. Appreciate you for taking the time to watch this. Talk to you soon.